Oh my goodness. This one surprised me so much. So I just poked it with my little tool to release the hair. And then I grabbed my tweezers. You know, I always flip them the wrong way. So then I started pulling it, right? And it kept coming and getting thicker. And I was like, no way. So I pulled it and then it cut. But then look it. I pulled this, right? And I was like, this feels interesting. And then you see how much more pulled out? And then I was able to get it. But yeah, okay, bye. Okay, so I got this new thing that holds my phone, but I kept hitting it so it was all moving. But look at how long this one is, okay? So this one was hitting under the skin, and then I pulled it out, okay? And then I, you know what I grab? My tweezers! As I keep hitting the thing and making it wobbly. You guys are gonna love this one, okay? Ready? So this is another ingrown, and I poke it to pull it out, but it was a little bit thicker. Like, I could literally feel it. So then as I pull it, it's crazy because the hair, like, pops out. Watch. Ooh! look ooh, okay so then i grabbed the hair think with my tweezers thinking that the whole thing would come out but it didn't but then when i grabbed it look another hair another hair so then i pulled in i thought it was two hairs but it was one okay this one was hella satisfying so i poked a little bacteria and then i just pulled it out and look oh that's it so, hey this one was a sneaky long one so i poked it through the little hole and look ooh, yes so you know what i grabbed you know what i grabbed my tweezers and then i just pulled it so. bada bing bada boom okay you can see the hair under and look how little i had to poke to get it this did not hurt her so i grabbed my tweezers and then i probably dropped them so oh no i did it okay then i grab it and then it slipped and then i pull it oh, okay so in this one i did an ingrown hair removal so i just poked the little thing and then i go into um pull it out with tweezers and just wait for it Ooh. oh yes for this one, the hair had come out and then it poked back in. So I just grabbed my little pokey tool, poked that. This part probably didn't hurt. Then I grabbed my tweezers. And then when I pulled it, it probably did hurt because it was still attached to everything underneath there. But yeah. Mm, okay. Okay, guys. So for this one, I used my little pokey tool. Got it on Amazon. It's a type of extractor. And then I pulled the hair out. And then you know what? I grabbed my tweezers. And then I pulled the hair out. And you'll see that this one's not really attached. So it didn't hurt when I pulled it out. Okay, bye okay so for this one it was pretty high up on the surface but it took a little bit to get it so i poked it with my thing and released the hair then i grabbed my tweezers moxie grab my tweezers then i pulled it out oh yes i love that okay so for this one i just poked the bacteria and then i was trying to get it through the loop but i kept missing like a dumb dumb so i finally got it through and then i go sorry and then i grab my tweezers and then this is going to be very very anticlimactic first it slips and then i grab it and oh, boom okay bye okay so for this one i just used my little poke tool poked it out and you can see it was a little bit inflamed because of the hair so i grabbed my tweezers and then i pulled the hair and hello everybody so for this one i put the tool through the little loop that was already made in the hair and then i pulled it out and then i grabbed my tweezers and then i pull it okay this one has been touched by oxygen that's why it turns black so i just poked the bacteria to release it from the skin no this does not hurt her then i grabbed my tweezers and then i pulled it but then there's still a little hair so i grabbed that one too okay bye okay so for this one i poked the little bacteria this did not hurt her at all and then i grabbed my tweezers and i always put them upside down so then i flipped it and then i pulled it this part probably did hurt just because it was connected okay bye okay guys so for this one i had a little bit more bacteria in it so i just poked it with the thing released the hair and then i grabbed my tweezers and then i pull out the hair and look at it mm, yummy okay so for this one i used my pokey tool and i poked it i got all these on amazon by the way don't really know what it's called and then i poked it and look at all that stuff that came out i mm, love it then i grabbed my tweezers and then i pulled the hair but not everything came so i got the rest of it and okay bye okay look at this one so i just poke it and when i poke it i'm not poking the skin i'm just poking the bacteria and then i grab my tweezers so if you guys want longer videos check out my youtube it's in the link Ooh, yes you guys are gonna love this one okay ready so this is another ingrown and i poke it to pull it out but it was a little bit thicker like i could literally feel it so then as i pull it it's crazy because the hair like pops out watch Ooh. look Ooh. okay so then i grabbed the hair think with my tweezers thinking that the whole thing would come out but it didn't but then when i grabbed it look 
another hair, another hair. So then I pulled in. I thought it was two hairs, but it was one. And oh my gosh, look at this one. Look, I pulled it. And look, 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 I pulled the whole thing. Like, I didn't even need my tweezers. And then I was like, okay, let me put another one in this video. So then you see the one right above. I was like, okay, let's poke it. But then I didn't need to poke it, really. So the way that that one was, I, like, poked through it, which doesn't hurt the skin. And then I just used the other side of the tool to just pull it out. And, yeah, this does not damage the skin because of all the skin prep I do before, okay? Here's the one you guys have been waiting for. Okay, look, so I poke it. I get the hair out. And, look, I knew it was going to be long. So I grab my tweezers. And then I grab it. And, look, oh, it just kept coming. Okay, so for this one, I did have to poke the skin a little bit because it was under there, but it's not going to do anything to the skin. It's so minimal. Then when it pops out, you know, I rub my tweezers and I pull it. If you want longer videos, check out my YouTube. Um, this one probably did hurt a little bit because it's still connected, but yeah, okay, bye.